Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today, we are going to solve our skill drag daily challenge using Python programming language. First, we will understand our question. We have to accept m and n integer as our input. Then, we have to form two list containing 1 to m and 1 to n. Then we have to pick one element from list 1 and one from list 2 so that so that their sum is divisible by 5 we have also given a note one integer in a list can be used only once. Consider an example where our m and n is 3 and 5. So our list would be 1 to m that is 1 to 3 and 1 to 3 4 5 which is 1 to n. Now we will use two for loops for val1 in list1 then for val2 in list2 now we will take our first element in the list and check with the other elements of the second list so that their sum would be divisible by 5 or not First, we will take the first element and iterate every element in this list, second list. So 1 plus 1 is not divisible by 5, 1 plus 2 is not divisible by 5, 1 plus 3 is not divisible by 5, 1 plus 4 is divisible by 5. So we have got one pair that is 1 and 4. Now we will check for our next element that is 2 where 2 plus 1 is 3 which is not divisible then 2 plus 2 is 4 which is also not divisible and 2 plus 3 is 5 which is divisible so we have got our another pair 2 3 then as you know 3 2 is divisible by 5 3 plus 2 so we have got also got our another pair that is 3 and 2 so the count of pairs is 3 so we have to print it as our output now we have to check with our conditions if val1 plus val2 modulo 5 is equal to equal to 0 and we are using a checklist to check whether the numbers are used or not from the list. So while 2 not in checklist then we are going to increment count by 1 then we use break. Before that we have to append the checklist by value 2. We have used break so that the elements are not repeated. Let us implement our program. We have to accept m and n integer using this map function. Then we will initialize the pair count 
equal to zero then assign checklist as empty then we use a for loop for val 1 for iterating from 1 to n and 1 to m we can also use list but as of now we will use for for val 1 in range 1 m plus 1 then for val 2 in range 1 and n plus 1 now if val 1 plus val 2 modulo 5 is equal to equal to 0 and val 2 is not there in checklist not in checklist we are going to increment the pair count by 1 then we have to append the checklist checklist dot append with val2 now we use a break so that the elements in the first list is not repeated then at last we will print the pair count this is simple right so let us execute our program we will give our first input the m and n so we have got the pair count as 5 which is correct then we will use our next test case where we have got pair count as 15 which is also correct hope you guys understand thanks for watching see you in next video